Oh my god, it's raining hard. It might be cold and rainy, but it is absolutely beautiful this morning out here on the pond. Let's give you guys a look what I see. All right, so I got two rods with me. Um, we're gonna do a two-pronged approach here. We're gonna use a spinner, inline spinner. This is a Panther Martin inline spinner with one of the rods. We're just gonna keep casting and retrieving, see if we can get a uh, trout to hit on the movement. And then we got this power bait, extra scent with glitter. And this is just gonna sit there in the water, let the line soak and see if the trout are more into eating something like this. So we'll do both. We'll see what works better. Um, hopefully double our chances for catching a fish. So we're gonna give it a cast. These rocks are probably super slippery. Oh, try not to eat it. Ooh. All right, there we go. Give it a cast here and then I'll uh, rig up my other rod while this soaks in the water. There we go. All right. Just gonna set my rod down right here. All right, so while my power bait is soaking in the water, I got my Panther Martin inline spinner tied on. So we're just gonna give this a few casts. I might try to walk up onto these rocks again. Hopefully I don't slip. If I don't get any action here at this spot, within a few minutes, I think I'm gonna switch spots. Leaves are slippery. Try not to fall. <sighs> here at our second spot. Oh wow, there's a lot of geese turd on that rock that I will not be standing on. Here we go. Oh man, I almost ate it right there. Whew, almost ate it. Somehow saved it though. Did not fall on some cold, slippery rocks or in the water. So I'll count that as a win. Reel up some of the slack. All right, so power bait rod is in the water. Got our uh, inline spinner in the other one. Let's give it a few casts. All right, so trout fishing was a bit of a fail. Uh, no activity at all. It's just tough. There's, uh, I think there's not that many fish left in the pond. It's been a while since they stocked it. Uh, and it's just a miserable day when it comes to weather. So moving on to our next course of action. Um, we're at a nearby pond, it's like a two minute drive from the one that I was just at. No trout in this one, but they do have bass chain pickerel perch so we're gonna see if we can just get any fish today any fish on the board I'll be happy with so stick around um, we'll give it a shot let's see how we do how eerie does this look there's like a light haze over everything all right a little a little sketchy whoa so this is a a boardwalk that goes through this bog i do not want to know what's in the water here this is kind of sketchy 
all the logs are pretty loose. I don't know what I'm getting myself into. This is literally crazy. I can't see where the water ends and the sky begins. This is not just the camera, like I literally can't see it with my eyes. This is nuts. It is surreal out here. Wow. Okay, so we'll be fishing this area first. It looks pretty weedy. I think there used to be a lot of lily pads here in the summer is what it looks like because I see a bunch of dead lily pad leaves. So I think we gotta do something weedless. Probably a Texas rig, maybe a crawl. Um, and we'll just pitch it into the into the grass there and see if we can get anything. All right, so this is what we're gonna use a Texas rigged crawl with a quarter ounce um, bullet weight. I think we're gonna just rip off some of its pinchers here. I think it's a little too long in case these fish want a smaller presentation. So there we go. Let's see how it does. All right, first cast. Oh shoot. Oh my God. This pond's iced over. This is ice, it's not water. Check this out guys, look at, check this out. Here's a rock. Oh, I didn't realize it was ice. I don't think it's all ice. Hold on. All right, so there's water down there all the way at the end. And then I think it just turns into ice. Oh, jeez. That's pretty funny. It looks like water to me, but there's a thin layer of ice on top. Oh boy, okay. Either I can bomb it, try to cast it a little further beyond the ice, or we gotta change spots. All right, this area is unfishable. Too much ice. We're gonna move over. I think there's a there's an area with moving water right down over there, so we're gonna check that out. All right, let's do a quick test to see if this is water or ice. Okay, water. That's good. Let's fish here. There's some moving water. There's like a little dam right here. And so the moving water is helping keep the uh, water unfrozen. I'm just gonna pop it along the bottom, nice and slow. This is so crazy. I like, can't see anything. It's all fog. This is wild. Oh, got a hit, got a fish, got a fish. Let's go, let's go, got it. Oh, what is it? Oh, yes. Oh, I knew it right around, the, right near that grass line. Oh, it's good. Is it a pickerel? It might be a pickerel. Oh, it's good. Oh, yep. Oh, it's a good one. What is this? It is a, yep, I think it's a, I think it's a pickerel. Oh, yes. Look at that. Oh, wow. Nice guy. Look at this guy. Oh man. Oh, little slime dart right here. Woo. Yes. I gotta get my pliers out. Yes. Get you unhooked. Oh man, look at this slime. Oh boy. Now these guys have teeth, so you wanna make sure you don't hook yourself, or you don't uh, get bit by them. All right, get a release on this guy. There he goes. Wow. Finally, first fish. Look at that fog. Do you see that? Look at that fog coming out over Wow
It might have been the hardest it's rained all, all morning. It's really coming down. Interesting day today. Came out here thinking we we're gonna catch some trout. Did not work out. Came to the second pond. Tough bite, but managed to land a decent pickerel. Um, enjoyed the beautiful views. Um, it's warming up now. The weather's honestly pretty nice. So all in all, a great day. Did not get skunked. Um, and had a lot of fun. So glad to be fishing in December and still getting bites. Um, hopefully there'll be more of that to come. So. Stay tuned and keep grinding.